Conor McGregor and Khabib Nurmagomedov, the feeling one gets is that if they did fight, it would be a complete shutout in one of two directions. <laughs> it's either like a man beating up a child on the ground, or it's just a flush knockout. The guy unable to cover distance properly and walking into a left hand and just being catastrophically KO'd. And yeah. you feel like it, it, there's potential for it to go in both directions. But Khabib is um, it's a much more dangerous form of control. Khabib, yes. uh, Khabib has a program of hitting people on the ground which is substantially better. Yeah, I agree. Um, I feel like what Connor presents that's interesting in terms of danger is speed and one-shot knockout power yeah. with his hands. Um, and the big difference is when Khabib gets you on the ground, you're not getting up. No, you're getting mauled, and it's almost like a spider. Like he's injecting venom into you and slowly <laughs> but surely like weakening your body. Yeah. Connor's kicks are just the opposite. His kicks are just probes. Mm. He's sort of poking at you, poking at you, and putting things out in front of you. And he's just trying to ding. He's just yeah. trying to drop that hard left hand on you. It's a fascinating guy to watch. Fascinating guy uh, to watch. I, I always undervalued him. When he first came to the UFC, I said, oh, it's hype, it's hype. But the more I studied, the more I saw. Yeah. yeah he's, he's very, very skilled.